It's time to take your home Wi-Fi experience to the next level. Today, we'll show you how to swap out your existing quantum fiber Wi-Fi equipment for your brand new Wi-Fi 7 devices. To get started, download the quantum fiber app from your device's app store or scan the QR code on the postcard you received with your new equipment. Based on your current equipment, you should have received these items. One Wi-Fi 7 wired device, one CAT6 Ethernet cord, and one power cord. You might have also received a Wi-Fi 7 wireless device. If you currently have four or more pods, you should have received just two new Wi-Fi 7 devices. With Wi-Fi 7, that's all you need to cover your whole home. Open the 360 Wi-Fi app to retrieve your network name, SSID, and password. Note any spaces, capitalizations, or special characters. You must replicate this exactly. You'll be prompted to unplug your old devices, but don't do it yet. Next, log into the Quantum Fiber app using the same login as the 360 Wi-Fi app. Tap Start Setup with the wired Wi-Fi 7 pod. On the What's in Your Box screen, tap Next. Allow camera access to continue. If you don't want to allow camera access, select Don't Allow, and you'll be prompted to manually enter the pod serial number. This field is case sensitive. You must enter your serial number using all caps. If you've allowed camera access, scan the QR code on the back of the wired Wi-Fi 7 device. Review the pop-up message, then tap Get Started. Unplug your existing wired Wi-Fi pod from the SmartNID. Remove the old Ethernet cable from the SmartNID. Your wireless service will now be temporarily unavailable during the upgrade process. Connect your new Wi-Fi 7 wired pod to the SmartNID using the newly supplied Ethernet cable. Plug the Ethernet cable into the LAN WAN or the 10GE LAN input on your smart NID. Tap Next. Connect your Wi-Fi 7 wired pod to the power outlet. Enter your Wi-Fi network name in the network name field. If you've chosen not to reuse the same Wi-Fi network name and password, you'll need to reconnect your devices to the new network name. Type your Wi-Fi password in the current network password field. Confirm your Wi-Fi password. Tap Next the system will add your new wired pod to your network. On the success screen, you'll see your new network name and the wired pod you just connected. Tap Done. Disconnect all of your old pods from power and set them aside. Your old pods will not work with your new Wi-Fi 7 pods. If you don't have any more pods to set up, tap No Additional Pods. If you need to set up more wireless pods, here's how. Go to the 360 Wi-Fi pod section in the app and tap Add Wireless Pod. Scan the QR code or manually enter the pod serial number. Connect your additional 360 Wi-Fi pod to a power outlet. For single-level homes, place the wireless pod between the farthest room where you need Wi-Fi and the smart NIT. For multi-level homes, place the wireless pod on a different level than the smart NIT. Want to give your 360 Wi-Fi pod a name? We suggest using its location, living room, office, or bedroom. You can also skip this step and name your pod later. Once the system has added the pod, you'll see your network name and the 360 Wi-Fi pods on your network. All set? Tap No Additional Pods. Your network will optimize itself over the next 48 hours. Congrats! You're ready to take control of your new Wi-Fi 7 equipment with the Quantum Fiber app. You can delete the 360 Wi-Fi app from your mobile device and begin using the Quantum Fiber app exclusively to manage your Wi-Fi network, your account, security settings, and more. You can ship the old equipment back to us at no charge. Your Quantum Fiber network is now Wi-Fi 7 enabled. We hope you enjoy a faster, smarter way to Wi-Fi. If you have any questions, visit q.com slash Wi-Fi 7 help.